Hey guys, Trickshot76 here, and we've finished the 2,500 subscriber contest. It ended two days ago, but because I've been busy doing the uh, results today, so that should be up hopefully later tonight, and then, if not tomorrow morning, and then you guys can see it. And anyways, so I want to thank all of you. Um, there's, I was going to say all 2,500 of you, but there's like 2,870-something of you now, so that's a lot more. Thank you, and we got a lot more entries this time. Um, for the first contest, we only had like five, six entries. This time we have a 21, so thank you all of you for showing up. I'm guessing I got better prizes this time. Um, so for future contests, I'll make sure to get decent prizes like this again. Yeah, so I went through, watched all the videos multiple times, put points up of which ones I like the most, narrowed it down to six, and then decided which order they should go in. So, before anything else though, because um, I said if we got between like 15 and 20 more uh, entries or something this time, I'd probably add another prize, and we got 21. So, I went to the store today actually, and I got that sixth prize, and it is the Star Wars Black Series Darth Maul, unopened in package, because I bought it today specifically for you guys. So, there's reviews of him up on YouTube already. I've heard it's a great figure. I don't own one of my, for myself yet. Um, but yeah, there's probably reviews of all these figures. So if you win and you don't know which one you want, you can check reviews of them online, see which one people say is the best. So that's a thing, too, you can do. Thank you all again, one last time. And, oh, I have a new video up. You should check that out because I put it up yesterday. And I put a new custom I made of Pixie, of the X-Men in it. And I'll be doing a review of it as soon as I finish doing a couple touch-ups I want to do. And then you guys can check that out too. Um, so now that I have all that out of the way, we can get into the actual contest stuff. So we're going to go from 6 to 1 to build the suspense. So that's what we're going to do. So in 6th place we have Hulk vs. the Avengers, or Avengers vs. the Hulk by Iron Man The Legend 11. Um, I really like this video, it reminded me of the Ultimate Avengers movie, except it had Hawkeye in it, and you can always have more Hawkeye. Lesson number one, okay? Now in fifth place, we have The Wrath of Beta Ray Bill by um, Ray Stop Motions. This one it was really cool, it had a bunch of jokes in it with Iron Man and Cap talking about the Avengers and stuff like that. Um, it was really funny. And then um, Beta Ray Bill had a T-Rex. Um, yell from Jurassic Park. <laughs> that always made me laugh whenever he yelled. <laughs> so, that was really cool. And then we get to see him throwing down a Thor. So, thank you. I liked that video. So you get fifth place in the contest. So, A plus for you. In fourth place, we have Ronin vs. Electra Assassination by DCU Maniac 999 uh, this is a really cool video. I like the rain effect they had at the, uh, he had at the very beginning. He built his own dojo for the fight scene. Yeah, that was awesome. So, you know, building your own sets. Tip number two of what to do that's awesome. So, do that if you can, obviously. Not everybody can, but if you can, sets. It doesn't have to be this elaborate, but that's the point. Lesson number one, add more Hawkeye. Lesson number two, sets help because it makes it feel like it's more of a thing a movie thing or an actual location than just action figures fighting third place because that's where we are at now we have spider-man and the hulk versus the juggernaut by gato pero i really like this video a lot it was really well done uh he didn't have the best of figures but he made it work he had giant sets with buildings that he smashed and cars and sound effects and talking, and I think there might have been music, but I don't remember, because I watched 21 of you guys' videos, and yeah. But this one is really cool, and I really enjoyed it, and I want to see more that you can do, and I want to see progress and get better. I want to see all of you guys progress and get better, obviously, but yeah. Uh, that's why you got a third place, because your video was awesome. So, now we are on to second place. Oh, should I give a tip? Are we doing this thing? Okay. Anyways, tip that 
when I got reminded of because of this video. If you have sets, then you have the ability to smash them. Buildings don't stand up forever, just like in Gatopero's video. You can make buildings get smashed and broken and windows fall out and cars get destroyed. Because that's what would happen if these people existed and were fighting in a city. So yeah, that's tip number three. And in second place we have The Rise of Ultron by Arkham City. This was a really cool video. He had dialogue and story and jokes. And then, yeah, he had effects too. I'm excited to see part two of the video that you will put up. So I'll be on the lookout for that. If it's already up, then it's cool I get to watch it tonight. If not, I'll watch it. Thank you for that video. So, yeah. Uh, I have no tip this time. Sorry guys, you got three tips already. Finally, the first place winner of the 2500 subscriber contest by Trickside726 is Wolverine Maximum Carnage by Super Power Stop Motion. So, this video was awesome. He had Venom and Carnage jumping around like animals, like they would, like it's been demonstrated in shows and movies and comics and games, and that was really cool. Um, he had Beast and Wolverine in fighting, there was blood effects and electrocutions and building climbing, and it was awesome. I loved it. It was absolutely amazing. So, that is why you got first place, sir. So, tip, I guess, that I got reminded of from this video would be make your characters act like they have, we've seen them do. So, yeah, just make the motions and things like they would. Like, I don't know, if you can do a punch, go don't go like, pa, go like, pa, you know? Just make it more fluid, make them do what they would do. Like, don't have Spider-Man just be like straight up boxing someone, have him do his flips and jumps and kicks and whips and stuff like that, like you would do. So, that is your fourth tip. We'll go over them again at the end, there will be a test. So, anyways, go over the places that everyone got one more time. So we've got... Iron Man, The Legend, 11, 6th place, Ray Stop Motions in 5th place, DCUC Maniac 999 in 4th place, Gato Perro in 3rd place, Arkham City in 2nd place, and Superpower Stop Motion in 1st place for the contest. So, yeah, I'm going to go over the prizes one more time for you guys. How this is going to work is um, Superpower Stop Motion, you get to pick out of the 6 of them you want first. And then Arkham City, you can choose out of the five that's left, and then Gato Pedro can pick out of the four that's left, etc., etc. Sixth place, you're going to get stuck with whichever's left, but you get something. So that's the good thing about it, right? So, anyways, prizes. We've got the DC Comics Unlimited New 52 Flash. So, it's a cool figure. And then we've got the Green Lantern Tomar Ray from the movie, and he's got pieces to parallax. And that is also really cool. We've got the DC Universe Beast and Batman, except he's not a DC Universe. Did I say DC? Marvel Universe. Okay, I know this. Don't comment in the sections about it. Um, so yeah, Marvel Universe Beast with 3 3 quarter inch Batman, who's also in scale with them. So you can have them do stuff together. Um, and then we also have... Star Wars Black Series Darth Maul, he comes with two heads, his dual lightsaber, and binoculars, or something like that. Then we've got Taskmaster and Claw. Taskmaster does not come with any weapons, he comes with his cape, and that's it, okay? Just making sure, so when people get it, they won't be like, why does he not come with anything? Uh, I, I mentioned he didn't come with anything. That's just how it happened, okay? So, no arguments there, I've mentioned it before, I've mentioned it now. Just the figure, loose. Anyway, he's the only one that doesn't come with anything. Everybody else will come with their stuff. Just because that's how it works. And then we also have the Iron Man 3 Wave Iron Patriot with Iron Monger Build-A-Figure chest piece. Lots of iron in that one. So that one's really cool. I have my own. Awesome figure. Same as the extremist Iron Man that came out earlier. Anyways, I'm not doing reviews right now. So those are the six prizes you can choose from. Taskmaster and Claw are one thing. Beast and Batman are another thing. They're two packs, as they would be. Anyways, so that's what those are. So you guys can choose from there. 
I'll message Superpower Stop Motion first, and then once he tells me he wants, I'll mention I'll message the you guys down the, as it goes down, to, telling you what's left. Then you can just tell me who you want, where to mail it to, and that'll be good. Um, I'm gonna ship them all loose because it'll be cheaper for me that way, and I'm paying for it. So unless you want to, if you want to pay for it, then I'll ship them in the box. But otherwise, you're getting them loose. And um, yeah, that's that. So thank you guys all for jo um watching this and participating in the contest. Oh, Nightlife Three will be up soonish. I, I can't tell you anything more than soon right now. Um, I'm waiting on the uh, lines from voice actors for like two people. Um, so I get those when I get those. It's when I get, I don't know. I don't have any control over it right now. But uh, if it's any consolation, I'm getting actual voice actors, not just myself, for this one. So that'll be cool. You're gonna hear other people's voices in it. It'll be like six or seven minutes long, I can tell you that much. Lots of time and effort into it, thousands of pictures. Uh, Storyline, outside, fire, electricity is obviously in it because Electro is in it, spoiler alerts. Uh, yeah, I'm really happy with how Nightlife Episode 3 turned out so far. So, uh, and I think you guys will be too. You're going to love it because I told you to. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's how that is. And oh, one last thing. Read the descriptions of the videos, because I, of the more recent videos at least, because I put time and effort into putting weird, silly things in there, like Skittles. Watch the, watch the newest video I did, uh, Mutant Pride, turn up your volume, and listen closely. Skittles. <laughs> Don't ask me what it's about, it's, it's classified. Um, so there's that, and yeah, thank you guys all for watching the contest video, um, Nightlife 3 will be up soon, watch the latest video, Mutant Pride, there should be a review of the Pixie custom I did, up soonish, I've got school and stuff, so whenever I get a chance to do that, I'll do that, and, oh, yeah, remember your tips, one, always add more Hawkeye, because you can, two, build sets, I think that was number two, three, destroy your sets, because it looks awesome, Four, do fluid motions, or try to make your motions more fluid and have their characters act like they would. So don't have them doing things that are uncharacteristic of the person. So like how Venom and Carnage are running like animals, they do that and the stuff, so it makes sense. Like you wouldn't have Captain America running like a cat. I mean, you could if you wanted to be silly or something like that, but it's, it's going to be weird. Um, so those are your four tips to go along with this. Um, yeah, if I haven't subscribed to some of you contest winners already, I will be because your stuff are awesome. The rest of you, keep working on it. I will watch your stuff too. If you want me to give you critiques on whatever or something like that, send me a video and then I'll give you some pointers on what you can do and stuff like that. Obviously, I'm not perfect. I could have stuff I can improve on too. But anyways... I have tried to end this video like four times and I've remembered something else. So, for the reels this time, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I will catch you guys later. Stuff will be up soon.